tricky one. I think they've all been a big part of me coming to rugby and playing. Uh, you know, my mum and dad, obviously PE teachers, um, so I've always grown up playing sport. My dad, football, and mum, more like netball and hockey and stuff like that. So there's always been a big mix of sports. I don't really know how we got into rugby, but all, th all uh, three of us got two brothers, play a bit of rugby Ross at the club. So I think they've all been quite influential in getting me to where I am now. Obviously being a club like Saracens who like to see themselves as a family orientated side, um, it's everyone, everyone into tight, everyone knows there's no one group of people who go away from each other, everyone's friendly to each other, everyone's kind to each other. Um, my dad, always growing up, uh, was the one that like sort of inspired me to play rugby and he uh, he brought me into the game, so probably him, and um, coming from, like, he played rugby as well, so having seen him play and stuff like that, probably him. My dad and mum all, and my little brother all came to watch my LV Cup game and obviously playing in LV Cup's a, a massive opportunity for me to get some first team rugby and hopefully get my name out there again. Um, by far my brother, far and away. Um, he kind of, he was the guy who got me started. I wanted to be him and everything, so he was the guy. He still, he still thinks he's better than me and stuff and terrorises me and about weight and whatnot and tries to beat me up and that. But. Yeah, he's a good guy. Uh, well, the obvious one would be, be Fred. But to be fair, all, all my family have been pretty influential. My old man plays at the ripe age of 54, so, so he's uh, he's a pretty big influence. But yeah, no, Fred obviously going through and, and becoming a professional player at Blossom and, and playing for England and stuff's uh, been a massive influence to me, so, so probably yeah.